How's it going? I'm Benjamin Davis. Um, I represent Team Shaolin MMA in Galway, Ireland, and also Ryushin Fight Team Dublin. So yeah, I'm here for Century and Fight Championships. Um, I haven't fought in a few years, and I'm looking forward to getting back in the cage to, sh you know, f finish off where I, I left off. Um, I'm fighting a guy, Russ Lam, I think he's called, Russ Lam. He's from Germany. So I don't know much about him. I was supposed to fight uh, Manuel Bilic, but he pulled out with a broken foot. So, you know, last minute change of opponents. So I, I didn't really look into the guy I'm fighting. I'm just gonna concentrate on my own, my own game. And then, yeah, try and assert myself, do my thing. Because when I was a kid, I grew up and I watched old Kung Fu movies, the really badly dubbed ones where the guys are like, you want to fight? <laughs> <laughs> and uh, yeah, they were Shao mainly Shaolin movies and I just loved the Shaolin. I love the Buddha bless you. I love the spirituality of it. And um, I love, obviously love the martial arts. And I think I always loved the, the respect and honor that they all showed and commitment to the martial arts. Like that was their whole life. And that's what it is for me. So like, you know, martial arts for me has been my everything has been it is life to me so Shaolin was just the name I had to almost out of honor and respect to where martial arts in the in the east came from you know I will say like even as a kid like I always kind of felt you know like because as I say I came up I grew up in rough places and you if you didn't fight if you didn't fight back, if somebody hit you, then you would be walked all over or you, you, you wouldn't survive really. So I kind of, I know that fear told me to want to, you know, overcome that fear basically. So it's always been about overcoming fear. And I think even to this day now, whenever I fight, it's all about overcoming fear, overcoming myself, all the negative energies. When the crowd barrel builds up, if they're booing me or if they're cheering me, you know, whatever it is, all the energy that's around here and all the energy that's going on in here. For me, it's about controlling that and visualizing and doing what, being able to let go of myself and just letting the martial arts do everything for me. Three, three years ago now, my little boy, Mateo, Mateo Davis was born. So after that, I thought I'm gonna take time out, concentrate on promoting my gym, helping my students, and um, yeah, and then training BJJ with my coach Hugo Burim, who's world class, you know. And um, so yeah, I just spent a long, like them three years, I wasn't fighting, but I was training, training all the time, and coaching my, my guys. So uh, you see in one of my guys in Austria, you know, I'm Ty Glenan, who fought and won. You know, we've got lots of guys coming through, lots, heaps of them, too many, I think teaching, teaching makes you a better martial artist because you have to analyze everything. You know, you have to teach things in steps. So, whereas you might do a technique, bam, done. You know, when you if you teach it, you have to show step stages. So it it makes your technique better, and um, I think it makes you a better person because you're sharing what you have. You know, you're sharing knowledge, which I think life is about sharing knowledge you know helping people progress and evolve you know that's that's the only reason i fight really to test myself and to, to share my what i've learned you know uh, my background is everything really school of hard knocks will say like you know i grew up in rough neighborhoods in both england and in northern ireland and um yeah I, yeah, I, I I boxed a bit, always into sports, done sander, done everything really, you know, like, you know, and but mixed martial arts. I'm a mixed martial artist, you know, I'm not a not a striker, not a jujitsu guy, I'm I do everything, you know. So I'm looking to I'll be striking to take the guy down. I'll be doing everything. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I just want to say big up to my gym, Shaolin MMA in Galway. And um, 
yeah, I'll be back soon. On, I come back, fly back on Sunday, so I'll be back training throughout the week. Want to thank Miller, my physio. Want to thank Jer Masterson, my nutritionist, for helping me being a pescatarian and all this awkward stuff is hard for, you know, for nutritionists. Um, Oli Manion, who helped me with my weight cut, and my wife Indra, the best wife ever, you know, who just puts up with my bad moods from having no food all the time and training all the time. And who else? Probably too many people. My mom, everyone who helps me in the gym, you know, for with my classes if I'm too tired, you know, everything. So just peace. All the Galway people, all the Irish people, all the Malta people, you know, all the Austrian people, you know, all the people of the world. God bless. Peace.